And MassDOT Secretary Monica Tibbetts Nutt and members of her team were in Greenfield today discussing plans to improve regional transportation and roads in western Massachusetts. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith takes us through some of the challenges that Franklin County is currently facing. The Secretary of Mass DOT and local transportation officials gathered at the Johnson W. Oliver Transit Center to discuss some of the challenges with transit services and funding to improve the roads in rural areas of Franklin County. Linda with Franklin Regional Council of Government says funding is one of the biggest challenges. There's not enough funding to fully reconstruct those roads, so some of them are hundreds of years old with antiquated culverts and drainage systems and with repeated storm events and repeated mud and mud seasons, those roads are in trouble. The Chapter 90 program provides municipalities with an annual funding source for investments. The average amount for towns in Franklin County is $229,653. And this has become a problem for towns as the cost to pave just one mile of roadway is about $340,000. The administrator with the Franklin Regional Transit Authority, Tina Cody, says potholes are another inconvenience for riders and drivers. Any pothole that you hit, there's always damage that could occur to our vehicle. It's not comfortable for the passenger, but just overall we're looking to hopefully get some um, more infrastructure work done. And MassDOT has been working around the clock to find ways to tackle the pothole issues in western Massachusetts. What we're looking at now are changes to materials that we're putting into potholes. We're also looking at the way we're doing construction of roadways and the materials we're using. So we definitely understand the issue. We are suffering throughout the Commonwealth about this. <laughs> And while there is some more work that needs to be done to enhance the transportation experience, some steps have already been completed, including culvert assessments, a new maintenance facility, and full weekend FRTA services. The secretary says MassDOT is committed to working towards more improvements throughout western Massachusetts, but it will take some time. Working for you, Kiara Smith, 22 News.